Hey guys, Flight Dutchie here, welcome back to Great Britain in our, well, a skeleton achievement run. Welcome back, it's patch 1.25.1 still, and uh, we are going for some more achievements. And I will go over those real quickly. We want still want the 100% mercantilism. Some in the comments said when you have a lot of mercantilism your colonies will become very unhappy. But uh, we will see how that will go, otherwise we will just lower it again. Uh, we still need to do the industrial revolution. Evolution, Anglophile, all the British and English missions, which is the uh, the base game of this run. Complete all the English and British missions, innovativeness, and maybe we can do this one. This sounds very fun as well, actually. If we do that in a later run, we already have two. We have this one and 20 boats of the Naval Doctrine. So uh, let's unpause the game. We are at war with Brittany. Malindi, the Papal State, France is sieging it at the moment. Um, would be nice if France could get here for me. We still have our vessels in Mexico, which was my mistake. Indeed, when you uh, uh, conquer the Overlord, you will get the vessels for free. And that is what happened. We uh, conquered the Mixtec over here. Where is it? Yeah, here's the Mixtec and their course. Uh, they had all the vessels. And that is how we uh, got all those vessels. So what is this? No, no more tariffs. Never. So I'm trying to get uh, Marahan out of the war, so we can piece him out first. Uh-oh. Uh, you have only 6,000 troops, Brazil? Why? That is nothing. Well, luckily we have our army over here. And converting... Wise... Uh. Which one do we want to do? Amsterdam? Yeah. Let's do Amsterdam. We still need to culture convert Amsterdam, by the way. To prevent the Dutch revolts, but... Um, therefore we need to make it Anglican first. We can change the culture right now to English. Um, it's not bordering, so that makes it, uh, I think, yeah, a bit more expensive. This is cheaper because it's by sea. So what I could do... Oh yeah, but French is, is accepted already. Norman is not accepted. I could make those uh, English, for example. And uh, you could make this all French. Or I will make this English and then make a bit more English provinces over here. Uh, we had a modifier, I think, for cheaper uh, culture conversion. Let's check this real quick. Where is it? Culture conversion. Somewhere over here. No? Where is that one? I don't know anymore. Oh, here. It's the ending of religious ideas. That is why religious is so good. It gives minus 25% culture conversion. And I think we also have a culture conversion mission to complete or something. I think we already did that with Scotland. And it's all new for me as well. But where was that one? No, let's promote culture cost. So that's not the one. But we have 25% cheaper culture conversion. That is really nice. When we have spare diplo power, we are going to do that. But we need spare diplo power for that. Because we need to stay ahead of technology. To keep the innovativeness going. We want 100. And that is not that easy, actually. You have to stay ahead all the time. Otherwise, you're going to lose it. Oh yeah, we have some problems with the clergy as well. How long? How long was that? Four years, we lose 10%. And this goes up with one each month. That is 48. Okay, we are fine. We are fine. We're blockading over here, but you're done. Where's the rest of the army? There it is. Go to Paris. Maybe we can kill those uh, people state army over there. 
we are still trying to conquer that one. And we conquered all of that. Now we can stand this army down. Because we need to conquer this province as well. We might start the annexation of uh, the Aztec and another one at the same time. Because uh, you will lose some Diplo reputation when you complete an annexation. Okay, you go there. Still making good money, yes. Let's check our buildings again. It's been a while that I was recording this, so I need to check everything again. Ah, that's a decent one, I guess. Some manufactories. Meh. Meh. And we don't need those two buildings at all. It's all fine. State edict map mode. What we were doing here. We have the cheaper uh, development over here. Because we need to get to 25 in the whole state. We have 20 everywhere now. 22 here. That's the trade one. That's in our capital state. So it's 50% cheaper. Then it's worthwhile to do it. Okay, let's see how strong we are again. 4.8 morale. 1.9 tactics. 110 discipline. That's going to be a very easy battle. We captured a ship from the Papal State. Why is that? I don't know. The Lubeck trade is here. The Royal Navy is over here. That's the European fleet now, yeah, that's the European fleet. And the American Navy is over here. You guys need to go to Brazil. For the rebels. I don't think they can beat those rebels on their own. If a free merchant as well, we need to take a look at that. That army is going in there. That army is over here. Trying to kill all of that. And you need to do the hunt for the seven cities again. There we go. I think I'm done now with everything. So where is where's this merchant going? I think we figured out last time that it is worthwhile to put one here. But I'm not sure anymore. We could put one over here. That's going to give us a lot of bonus because it will be, it will get a bonus here and here and at the Ivory Coast. So we should put one over in the Gulf of Aden. I think that's the one. Yeah, just put it here. No trade to uh, Middle East. All goes by around Africa. Ooh, that's a nice one. 25 admin power and innovativeness. Thank you. Tech-wise, we were not that far ahead, so we are going to get a next idea group. And we will go for uh, admin... No, um, ex expansion ideas. So we have an extra colonist. Course are coming in. Yeah. It's really good. Revolt risk. Almost done. Okay. It's going really well now. see in Europe if we can convert something over here. Uh, busy building. Oh well. Um, hmm. I think we uh, did almost everything in this region. We could uh, include subjects and uh, convert their land as well. So maybe we should just go to the cheaper ones. Like some Norwegian stuff. And talking about that, we should go after Denmark and uh, sneak up Bremen. Do we have our permanent claim there already? Yeah. No. Yes, we do. But if I go to war with that right now, I have to fight the Emperor. No, why not? Ooh. Well, well, well. Really? What is our aggressive expansion in this region? It's really low. Austria is, uh, and Spain are uh, terrible. <laughs> Spain is uh, a truce for 12 more years. Austria, 6 more years. Um, it looks very tempting. We could just take Bremen and attack Bremen over here. Or Lübeck. What will happen if I attack Lübeck? We have to fight the whole trade league. No. Bremen. If I attack Bremen. 
Lübeck will join, Mecklenburg will join, Hamburg will join, and Denmark, and that's it. And I would love to have more trade power in this region, because there is so much trade here. I think we are going for that war. Take Bremen and maybe another one. Maybe Lübeck as well. And we can complete a mission, I think. Where is that one? Bum, 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 bum. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Control the Hansa. Yeah. Then we can go to Gdansk and Riga. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, yeah, we are gonna go and do that war after this is over. So we can peace out this guy. We have almost no money. Coalition is uh, almost nothing, so we will do this. Race and core. Diplomatic approach. Thank you for the power. High liberty desire. The Aztecs I have a high liberty desire. Why is that? Will this help? I never did this before. Okay, it doesn't. I need to figure it out by just doing it, I guess. But can we peace out you, Papal State? Can I give this to uh, France? What happened with Kilwa? Check that out soon. Uh, of course we could release some nations, but we don't have this dipl dip diplo slots. We can't. Okay. Go over here. What happened with Kilwa? Is Kilwa out of the game? I think Kilwa just got uh, wrecked. Okay, come back. And now we have to start... Now we have to uh, improve with one of those others. We are, we are busy with Tlaxcala, right? Yeah, so the Aztecs and Tla Tlaxcala are the ones that we are going to integrate. I could influence you. Also didn't help. Why is so high? Oh yeah, I, I enforce the religion. Whoops. <laughs> But we don't have to annex them right now. We can wait a bit longer. We need uh, 200 opinion of uh, Mexico here as well. Before we can do that. Okay, you're going in. Holland is now an electorate in the empire. Low. They can vote who, who will become the emperor. And... Issue Granada is a good one to convert. How much money do we make? We could maybe start another colony. How much do I pay now? Then I'm going to pay around 40. Yeah, sure. So we are here at St. Lucia, Paramaribo, Martinique. Come back. And we are in Australia. Uh, we still need more provinces in this uh, region. I'm gonna send one over here. We are trading in fur. That's really good. You are annoying. Oh yeah, and we still have the religious struggle, the religious war over here. Is there a religious war map mode? That would be amazing. So Paradox, if you are watching, Make a religious war map mode. So we can see which nations are against who. If there will be a war. Okay. I didn't make them co-belligerent, I think. And that is going to give way too much aggressive expansion, so we cannot take any papal land. Nope. We can't. We 
You don't accept. Oh, but you are gonna accept soon. And France took your province. So. I'm gonna wait for that. What are you doing? You are... You need to be part of the European fleet, I guess. I have no idea. Going to the North Sea. Yeah, we have an African fleet. American Navy. And the European fleet, so... I guess it's part of the European fleet. Yeah, I think so. What is the attrition over here? That's way too much. Infantry, go out. We can take in the technology. Um, do we get the innovativeness if we do this? Nope. So we can wait. One more, two more months, and then we will have it cheaper. Let's take that back real quick. The British Mexico treasure fleet arrived. So we get treasure fleet right now, and we are making tons of money. Did the one at uh, the Gulf of Aden do something? Oh yes, 4.88 to 11. To 11 again. To 20. So we steer 20 from the Ivory Coast to the English Channel. Now we have 133 here. We are rich bastards. Really rich. Is Portugal colonizing? Yeah, they have a colony over in this island. We have the Siege of Makua. So we can now separate piece this guy. No, why not? Now they are going to accept that soon. Trust me. We just need to make sure that we are trying to kill his uh, army. That's very important. Oh, Melindian peasants. So let's... Uh, Go over there. Uh, Sevilla, convert Sevilla. Too many free diplomats actually. What are we gonna do? France. Let's improve with him a bit so we can keep him happy easier. There's the army though. There's the Makuan army. If we kill that one, then they want to peace out. For sure. We can uh, go and... Take the technology. Oh yeah, and we still have, don't have the institution. That is true. Uh, how is the institution looking? So it is in London. And it is spreading. But really slowly. But it would be nice if we can get this. Maybe a bit quicker. That's minus 10 development. Let's use that over here. I'm just gonna pu put our points here in this... Uh, in this region. That's 25. Need a bit more here. I'm going to spend the points now. There's no need for us to uh, spend more when we can do this and get more printing press and wait for it to spread. It's, it's, it's very expensive right now to go up in tech. So we should do it this and uh, get some discounts with the points over here. I think that's a better thing to do. Like this. 25-25. You need a bit more.
There we go, 25, and now you. There we go. Now this whole state is now uh, done for our achievement. Yeah. So you are done, and now you can get the institution spread modifier. So I don't forget it. When it's uh, done over here, it will spread quickly to this region. We're gonna wait for that. So it is spreading over here, right? Yeah. Yeah, we are gonna get it soon. I think. Alright, um, Aztecs, how are you do looking? Still don't want to, but soon you will. Tlaxcala, we can influence you. Become a bit happier. I think we might be able to peace out, but we can do that in a couple of uh, months. Stop. You are going to Madeira. You're gonna kill the rebels. There are rebels everywhere, it's always the same in this game. We are gonna take the fort back. Before we arrive there. And we have to siege everything again. Mercantilism. More mercantilism. Trust me, they will they will siege this province back, the capital of our war goal. They will. Before we arrive there. They are at 0% but they are the AI. They are going to do it before we arrive. Trust me. Another influenza event. So if we quarantine the province it might go away. It doesn't cost any uh, admin points anymore. Back in the days it cost admin points, I think. It was really stupid. Okay, we are actually gonna make it. I did not expect this. And the civil war in Melindi. We have to fight those rebels now as well. It is horrible. No, 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 look. The AI is going to attack me. With their noble rebels because of the civil war. And then I cannot make it here. And then the peasants are going to siege back the capital. Look. Look what happens guys. And. Hmm. I'm impressed. They didn't take it. Wow. The AI is once uh, forgiving. Okay. Can I peace out. Akua. Yes. Thank you for the province. Race and core. You are not part of the trade company. No. And now we need to piece out Melindy. We need to piece out the Papal State now. <laughs> the Papal State is in London, guys. <laughs> oh my god. Really? We own almost all of the coast of uh, Western, uh, Eastern Africa, I mean, that's so nice. And we lost all our troops. <sighs> really? Okay, there's our diplomat, we can now peace out here. We are not going to take any land because that will be too much aggressive expansion, but we will take all your money. I want you to stop your alliance with Bohemia. Stop anything with the Ottomans. And Austria. I want your war reparations and that's it. Get the hell out of this war. Pope. Fake Pope. And then we take all of Brittany. Yeah, I'm gonna take it anyway. 
Oh, I have to take their colonies. I almost forgot about the colonies. That one, St. Thomas. And that's it. And a bit of money. Let's wait one more month to tick down the aggressive expansion. So Brabant and Huron won't join a coalition. Because then they are below 50. It's only annoying. Take that general and kill them. Already. Yeah, keep converting. You're making good amounts of money. Looks really good. Wait one more month until January, then we peace out Brittany, then we finally have a nice border. And we own all of the coast of uh, here, then we only need Portugal, and then we have... Uh, oh, and these provinces here. Then we own the coast from uh, Holland... ...to uh, Gibraltar. Would be uh, very nice. Okay, peace out. Ninety percent overextension. We have to watch out for that. But I want to court this myself because we have permanent claims here. It's going to be very expensive. Wow. Very expensive. Root out corruption. We have ninety-nine percent overextension. We cannot peace out Malindi at the moment. Wait. Uh, do I want to raise the uh, autonomy? Yes, I do. Still not in the age of absolutism, so then we can. We cannot raise it in Anjou here. That's annoying. Let's put an army in this region. Alright. Fine. How much overextension is this? Yeah, too much. We need to wait for this uh, to, to peace out. It's going to take some time. That's going to be the end for this episode, guys. Thanks for watching. In the next episode, we will peace out Malindi. We will start the annexation of two vessels here. Because we need to be at peace for that. And then we go to war again. I think. If the Hans are over here. The, Han the Hanseatic League. Take Bremen and Lübeck. Please like and subscribe to the channel if you liked the video. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye bye.